Hi, video 267. The Lancasters coming to the end of the 11am taxi run. This week, Jacob's removing more skins off the wing ribs. Dave's fitting the first of the three skins to strengthen the door frame. Gerald's working on the nose section of the fuselage into costal. Chris left him this task while away on holiday in the Netherlands for the 80th anniversary of Operation Market Garden. Case, the volunteer from the Netherlands, is helping out this week. Four pillars are in place John was working on last week. These are for the wing jig. E2 is in Holland for the 80th anniversary of Operation Market Garden. Hopefully he'll be back next week to complete the task. That the one you made the other week. Which one? That uh, you was tapping it out. Yeah, that was the one I made the other week. That's the one you were tapping out, was it? Yeah. It came okay. No cracks or anything? No, no cracks at all. Oh, that's good. It came out all right. Yeah. Isn't yeah. Dennis in this morning? Uh, no, Dennis is on holiday at the minute. Yeah. Yeah. We're all on holiday this week. Yeah. yeah. Okay. This is the first skin, is it? Yeah. It's, it's that side and then there's one very similar this side that I have to put on and there's another skin that goes on top of both of them and then the goes all the way around that the other yeah skin. another C shape yeah. yeah and then there's the obvious the, the top skin goes over the top of them so it's quite quite beefed up I mean that's 70 thou thick so yeah, 70 thou 70 oh. thou that one yeah quite but beefed gone, it's a good tough piece of material isn't it yeah and then you've got 32 thou on top and then 32 thou skin on top of that yeah. And that's the only thing you've got to show us, is it? Yeah, I've only been back. It's only my second day back, so... <laughs> Why, well, did you come in Monday? I did, yeah. So I'm working Mondays now instead of Friday, so... Oh, are you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll get, I'll get more done, so... Yeah. yeah. Works better. Yeah. I'll let you carry on. Oh, and this is the other side you're making? Yeah, of the, yeah, the yeah. doorway? Yeah, I've roughly, roughly trimmed it out, so... Yeah. Once I've drilled that one off, then this one can go on. Yeah. And then there's like a packer that goes along the doorstep between them to, to level it out so the next bit of skin can sit flat on it. Yeah. Yeah. When it comes to putting the top skin on, isn't there going to be a bit of a step? There is a slow one, but if you look down there, there's, a, there's actually a chamfer on that edge. Oh yes, yeah. So as the skin goes over it, it follows the chamfer down and, and blends in. Yeah. And that, because 70 thou would be a massive step yeah. for it. Um, so obviously that chamfer, it just blends it away, but yeah. um, it seems to work. Uh, yeah, and obviously it needs, it needs that much peeping up around the door. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Going to our bigger empire, anyway. We've expanded, haven't we? Yes. Gone out this way. Oh, you have, haven't you? Yeah. That's the reason. They've got more bend space now. Yeah. Yeah, we've moved out that way. Yeah. Down the six foot there. We needed it, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, good. Yeah. Are you making intercostals Chris left you to do? I am, but. Um, I don't know, I've made it, it's there. I'm just trying to work out how to make these holes. But it bent over okay, did it? Yeah, yeah, it went to... Well, there were two to do, weren't they? No, well, you only gave me the one, but, uh, oh. yeah, that one's, yeah. It only bent, bent fine. Yeah, So oh, I've got good. to, um, just going to put the... 
got to put the holes in now, eh? The holes in, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Got me cranked back. Oh, did you? Oh, did they go just 10 thou down? 10 thou on all of them. Yeah. That was good, wasn't it? Yeah, it's the guy to save it at 10, on. yeah. Yeah, so I've cleaned all the oil ways out and then I'm just waiting for the shells and it can, yeah. it can start going back together. Good. You dust off it? Yeah. It is quite bad in here. Yeah. It'll be alright, that will yeah. I'm just getting all the bits ready so I'm not going to go rooting around for all the nuts and bolts. I'm just making sure yeah. I've got everything. And when's the bearings expected? Oh, I should, this week I should think. They didn't come with a crank light, they didn't supply them. No, I, I knew that I could get them so I said to them. Yeah. I'll source them from the David Brown place. So. And this is a, a David Brown what mark or what? VIG slash 1C slash 1A slash AM. Oh, is it? Two. I, I think something now. like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's got the engine numbers here, which confirms that it's, a, it's an Air Ministry engine. Good. It's a nice paint you're putting on them. It's and High temperature black, yeah. Yeah. Just rattle cam. Oh, is it? Mm. Yeah. I'm really pleased with the finish. Yeah. yeah it's built to last. Yeah. Are they cast iron and heads? Oh, yeah, I don't think they certainly weigh enough to yeah. me. It's certainly not aluminium. No. <laughs> that probably weighs about as much as a Lank cylinder head, that thing. <laughs> That's yeah. a Merlin one, rather. Yeah. No, oh, the more weight, the better. The more weight, the better, yes. Yeah. Everything is heavy. The coolant pump weighs half a tonne. I mean, it's... it's oh, the cast iron one again. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, I mean, you won't. You won't damage it. You better get all that. I've only got one out, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, just, it's an it area, is, so yeah. everything's up. Well, it's better than having a load of ballast. Well, yeah, it's got that as well. Well, it's got, yeah. I mean, the thickness of those material. Yeah. There's all weights. I mean, there's a weight yeah. here. There's two weights here that I took off the um, Yeah. Rack, one of which fell on my foot, which smarted a bit. Toe protectors? Well, it missed the toe protector. <laughs> it went there, oh. behind the toe protector. Yeah. And all the weights on the side. Yeah. I mean, it weighs four tons. Yeah. Jacob Tate has taken up earlier. All the pattern for making the tailplane ribs, courtesy of BBMF. Jumpers on me. Yeah. 
I have put in reinforcements up in here, behind this one. It will be placed in here, in this section. And I have to clip it on now, and then I have to drill it. Two skins go down that chamfer you put on, all right. That's what I'm trying to check up now. couple of little Clico clamps to do it for the end here norm. On this end here a couple of little Clico. Just drill yeah just drill some out. I was gonna say I need to just Clico them on. Yeah the Oh yeah I mean yeah 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 sorry I'm with you yeah yeah I'll get some out of the kit. Yeah on we Dave not in this week? He's in tomorrow. I thought it worked Monday and Tuesday, you know. Uh, just not this week. It's a thick hefty piece, that's 70 thou, isn't it? Is, it yeah. yeah, it is, yeah. That's what I'm filing. I, want, I just wanted to see how that sits there, but you, yeah. you actually looking at that. And you can't tell. You can't really tell. Well, you no. can sort of tell it's there, but it's not dead no. obvious it's there. No. But you have got a, a rivet hole pretty close uh, to where the chamfer ends, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. On the stringers. Do. And I'll go in, we'll have a look, get a mirror and have a look and see how it sits right there. Well, shall I get a couple more of them clamps and put one top and one bottom? Yeah, yeah. I don't know if they'll work, they might not. That one, the bottom one will work, but the top one probably won't. Because mm. they don't open wide enough to go over the stringer. It's a good job, isn't it? It's nice it's and smooth. Massive, it's not massively obvious, is it? Yeah. The other, the other skin comes to the... Comes the to there. The, so the second, form, the second huh? one comes to there, and then obviously the rest of the skin goes all the way to the end. Yeah. And where does it finish at the top? Uh, the end. Look, the draw, say, look at that drawing there. D2061. It's there, look. The, the little drawing. This one? Yeah. yeah. This is the sec. Is it one piece? No, it's two pieces. Two pieces. Join there. So it, it, it basically goes from there, around there, to there, and then it goes back to here. That piece is not on that drawing, but we took them off. Yeah. And they've got numbers on them, but we haven't got the drawing. There you go, then, Norm. So they're all drilled out, are they? Dish? Now that I've pulled that tight there, it's more obvious. Well, I mean, it's bound to be, isn't it? Yeah. You can just, only just feel it. I was thinking what I might do is get, um, go inside, get the drill, and just drill those first three holes there, those first three holes there, same there, and then drill a couple of these through, just so we, just so we can hold them Clico three pieces in with the clicker, clickers rather than brackets. Or even the thumb screws. Yeah, yeah, just see how it sits. Okay. 
just put the, the reinforcement bracket in here. Now I clamped it in place. And then I'm going to drill all these holes on the right size so that the rivet will fit into them. Are they countersunk or not? They're all countersunk on the top side. Yeah. And these were done before. Yeah. But this is this is it was not done yet, so no. I had to do it later. Yeah. Oh, good. Well done, is it? So far, yeah. So what are you going to do now? Rivet it up or take it, it off? It has to be riveted off. We have to repair this one and we're going to do that later. Yeah. Because this was in the way we couldn't drill the holes. Yeah. So we had to take that one out. And once yeah, with this is riveted, right. we can reinforce or put that back and then start working on this area. Yeah. You get that done this afternoon? Don't know yet. Yeah. Depends where my hands are needed. Oh, I see. Might be that I'm busy over there with the door yeah. the reinforcements. Yeah. Because they need to, to drill a lot of holes so that it's easier yeah. when they have somebody on the inside yeah, of holding a piece of wood on the back and then they can drill the holes easier. Yeah. Yeah. Does that have to be inspected by Bob or anybody before Nor you normal do normal do yeah. in inspection, yeah. yeah. I'm I'm allowed to do it but it will be inspected because I don't yeah. have the certificate to yeah. sign for work like that. Yeah. But yeah. it's, it's, it's fun. Yeah, good. I'm sorry, but I forgot your name again. Case. Case. That's Remember, nut case, test case, uppercase, lowercase. This is how you write it. Yeah. You oh. pronounce it like C-A-S-E. Yeah. Make, make a picture of it. Oh, let's have a picture of it. How about that? This is Case, and whereabouts are you from? I'm from the, the south of the Netherlands, near the city of Eindhoven. Yeah. And you just come over here and open I'm, that. I'm here for a week now to lend a hand and to learn a thing or two in, yeah. in the process. It's a good working hobby already. Yeah, it, it's a hobby <laughs> that got out of hand a bit. Yeah. Right, thanks Casey. Good luck to you. You're welcome. Going okay? Going okay, is it? Yeah, just the fiddling around. You get the right position for the bracket. One of the holes had cracked, hasn't it? One of the holes had got a crack in it. Yeah. That's what the repair that's is. Why, that's why the reinforcement is in here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you, you can't win them all, eh? No. And now it's easy to repair it because there's no skins and there's yeah. nothing on it. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise you would have another problem. Yeah. What more work?
How are you doing, Terry? You what, mate? How are you doing? I'm all right. I'm back filing feathered edges again. What is that? 75 pounds? 71. 70? 71. 71, is it? Excuse me. Ooh! Bright lights, who's done that? Don't know. I think that needs a bit of a tap with Amber, it's not very flat. <laughs> okay, lads, see you next week.